Hi, I'm Chuck at Inline Tube, and today we're going to show you how to use the TLF-08 Lever Actuated Flaring Tool. This Inline Tube Professional Grade Flare Kit will form 45 degree double flares, metric bubble flares, and hose beads on OE steel, automotive grade annealed stainless, and any soft metal tube. The TLF-08 kit contains a 3 16 to 3 8 and 4.75 millimeter die selector, 3 16 to 3 8 and 4.75 millimeter die blocks, flaring tool mount, and handle. With the tube prepped and ready, open your TLF-08 kit and grab the flaring tool mount. Place the mount inside the vise and tighten the vise. Next, grab the handle and connect it to the mount. Choose the appropriate die block and place it inside the yoke assembly. Close the yoke assembly, press the black knob in and slightly tighten the top of the yoke assembly handle to hold the die block in place. After your die block is secure, slide your tubing through the die block. Tighten the yoke assembly handle one more turn this will allow the die selector to properly align the tubing with the die block. Now grab the die selector and rotate it to OP0. OP stands for operation. With the die selector at OP0, grab the handle of the mount and push it forward to make the tubing flush with the die block. Once the tube is flush with the die block, tighten the yoke handle to secure the tubing in place so that it won't move. Next, rotate the die selector to OP1 and the appropriate tubing size. For this demonstration, we'll be using OP1 5 16 tube. Once you have chosen the correct size, grab the handle of the mount and push it forward. Remember, when the handle won't go any further, OP1 is done and you have a perfect bubble flare. Now, switch the die selector to OP2 and the corresponding size that you will be using. Just like the last op, we will set the die selector to op 2 5 16 Grab the handle of the mount and push it forward to create the 45 degree double flare. With the flare complete, release the mount handle and loosen the yoke handle. Finally, open the yoke assembly, remove the die block containing the tubing, and inspect your 45 degree double flare. The TLF-08 can also be used to create hose beads, commonly used on fuel and transmission lines. To complete the hose bead, choose the appropriate die block and place it inside the yoke assembly. Next, close the yoke assembly, press the black knob in and slightly tighten the top of the yoke assembly handle to hold the die block into place. After the die block is secure, slide your tubing through the die block. When the tubing reaches the end of the die block, Tighten the yoke assembly handle one more turn. Now, grab the die selector and rotate it to OP0. With the die selector at OP0, grab the handle of the mount and push it forward to make the tubing flush with the die block. Once the tubing is flush with the die block, tighten the yoke handle to secure the tubing in place so that it won't move. Next, rotate the die selector to OP1 and the appropriate tubing size. For this demonstration, we'll be using OP1 for the 5 16 tube. Once you have chosen the correct size, push the handle halfway forward. Now release the mount handle, loosen the yoke assembly, and inspect your hose bead. If you have any questions, visit www.inlinetube.com and click the live chat button in the bottom right corner to speak with an expert. Don't forget to click the subscribe button below and like, comment, and share our other videos.